Hey everypony, welcome back to more uh, Twilight's Escape. Last time we were chased by the black thing and we saw some little uh, sunlight thingies at the end of last time, so maybe we can leave soon. I wonder how long this game goes, everypony. I have no idea. Okay. Um, judging by whatever happened last time when it came to those switches, I just... I just expect something to chase me the second I hit this. Go. Just don't even look back. I know it's right behind me. Oh no! Just... No, no, no! Keep going, Leaf. Keep so going. No, I think this is his weakness, right? The sunlight, right? He hates the sunlight, doesn't he? Just as I expected last episode. Was it the sunlight? He does not enjoy the sunlight, every pony, just like we predicted. <sighs> I can't believe we got past all the weird jumps, every pony. I was so low on stamina, I thought I was gonna fall down the pit any second at the end. Okay. You're still there. It's too far to jump, but I can teleport that. Go, Twilight! Teleport! Okay, what's happening? Okay, let's recharge our magic a little bit. Can we make that? I think we can. Okay. So what is this? More sunlight. Another key. And it presumably goes into this door. Let's go this way. Okay. Whoa, the sounds weird. Uh, let's see. Is there anything to do here? So if I go to the menu, will it save? Okay. Wait, what's this? Oh, this is the amounts of, of amounts of levels. Oh, so we're close to the end, everypony. I didn't expect this. Okay. One second, everypony. We're gonna go back into the level and see if it's any better with the sound. Okay, so we're back here again. I don't know if it's much better, though. I wonder what's going on, every pony. Uh, let's just keep going. I don't think there's that much to do anyway. Or left to do, that is. The ray of hope that started with the finding of the light had grown into a beacon that had pierced through all the fright. For just a moment, Twilight stopped and pondered what she learned. Though once she was a prisoner, she felt the tide had turned. Her son had kept the beast at bay, at least to some extent, and any such advantages would help with her ascent. This also got her wondering, and slowly it made sense. This weakness could be used as more than just her own defense. Oh, okay, so we now know that the sunlight is something that the little um, black thingy does not enjoy very much. Okay, so the way I see it, there is three levers that we have to find. Okay, let's check check all the nukes and crannies for any more doors because that's something that got me in the last episode really badly. So let's just go for this one. Okay. okay. I'm trying to stay here and see if there's anything happening in the corners, but I don't see anything. Okay. Is this some sort of puzzle? Nothing over there. I don't see any more sunlight either. Okay. Okay. Oh, I get it. 
Wait, what? I didn't see it yet, every pony. But apparently Twilight did. Where is it? There we go. It's on me. Just run for it. Just run. Just run. Just run. Just run. The sunlight. Okay. So the second one is in this corner, right? Okay. Good enough. It's number two. So I understand that the switches help me move forward, but they also set up traps in this door, in this little room right here, turning it into a bit of a maze, right? That's what I've gotten. Just run, just, just, just go, just go, just go. It's in the back of the area anyway. We're safe. <gasps> no, we're not! It's not in the back of the area! Mm. I didn't ever notice it go to the front. I thought it was in the back. Mm. Okay, but we know where the sunlight is, and that's what we're gonna have to use. We're gonna have to use the sunlight to dance around him. But it also helps that we know that he only spawns after we trigger the first lever. So the logical choice is to go to the far right corner and trigger the first one there. So we have less running to do when we're trying to get out of here. Um, the sunlight is... Oh gosh. So he does not need anything to spawn. He's just right there. Go here. Okay. I've totally lost my way. Uh, where was he? Hey there. Come, get me. Get me. Is he gonna come get me? He doesn't like this stuff, doesn't he? Huh. Okay, does he ever leave me? Okay, the, so the sunlight only protects you if you like stand behind there. But like he can pretty much camp you there as soon as you're standing there. So let's try to avoid that. Okay, so let's let's keep a lookout for it this time. Since, he, since we know he's already there at the start of the game. He's not there. I see some sunlight. He's right over there. Okay. Did he go this way? the next path okay go this way quickly open it okay that's one down okay so let's see does every switch bring different obstacles or does it like does it not matter in which order I do these okay let's just go just run for it just run for it straight and arrow just run for it come on leaf Go as quick as your hooves can carry you, Twilight! I can't believe this worked. I can't believe this is even remotely going to <laughs> going well. Okay. Now the problem is the last switch isn't a tough spot to get. Okay. Not this way. But this way. Just go, just go, go, go for the end, go for the end of it. Just run, just run, just run, just run. Leave it, leave it. Go here, go here, go here, go here. Just wait it out. Let's see where he's at. Okay. Gonna have to make a right up ahead. I see it. Okay, I see. Let me teleport. Go. Okay. Activate it. Quickly. That's the third one. Okay, Twilight, charge up all of your magic. We're gonna have to make a, a really good teleport up. 
ahead. <sighs> Every pony. I swear without teleportation this will be so much more difficult. Twilight, you need to charge up your magic. We need every speck of magic that you can get, Twilight. Okay, that's her magic charged up all the way. Now we just have to get past the, the square... No, not the square, the, cer the weird... thingy. Okay, go. Go. Go! Good thing that I'm usually pretty s solid with my magical abilities. <coughs> the cracks of sun grew frequent now as Twilight would press on. In there are death traps in the game. The unicorn was drawn. To see them raise her spirits and almost made her want to sing. Their number and their brilliance could only mean one thing. The surface couldn't be too far, perhaps one floor or two. For the first since showing up, she felt she might pull through. And so with freedom close at hook, she felt determination, and bravely galloped onward to obtain the liberation. Let's go, every pony. I think we're close to the end now. Okay. Run back here if I need to. But those things are death traps. We've learned this the hard way. Let's save our stamina. Okay, that's another magical one. What, what does this open? Where is it? Oh no! That's it. Come on! Come on! Huh? So this switch is a trap. What does it do? It like closes behind you. I'm trying to figure out what to do with that switch. Run back here if I need to. Okay, so let's go over here again and see what this does. So the second eleven, I get this one. Okay. The sunlight goes away. But this also opens. I am near the surface. So how do I exactly work with this? What does this do for me? Okay, what if I just run to the start right after hitting this? Are you ready? Go. Bad idea! Bad idea! Bad idea! Okay, is this gonna do anything? Is this close enough? Probably not. Nope. Okay, how do we beat this? Okay. But we at least now know, as soon as hit the switch, it's gonna come barreling down this hallway. So just hit this. Whoa. I am near the surface. Okay, this is really difficult. I have no idea how to beat this. Okay, so what's behind here? And I can't teleport there. Nope. Is there any other area that I can teleport to? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I think I have an idea. There's a spot that I can teleport to, I think. I just don't know how much range these red things have, but what if I can teleport, like, into there? Does that work? It is not. Okay. So what do I do? What does the game want you to do, though? <clears throat> oh, do I have to trap him? In here? Oh, it's not coming this time. It is. It is coming this way. What am I supposed to do with this? I'm to- oh. 
what if I loop him around in that room and then run there, right here? <clears throat> That's something I could do. That's it. We have to run back here, but only after we've looped him around here. Okay, let's do it. Go for it. Let's do it. Okay. Huh? That also closes. Okay, I'm honestly lost at what to do now. I have no clue. I know the game somehow wants you to go back here, but there's no clue what to do now. Okay, but I I understand that as long as you're standing back here, you're not triggering him. So let's see, what does this do? Just closes the door. Is there some way to get him locked in that corner? That could be a thing. What if there's some way to get him locked there? And that, I don't know what locks this thing. So if I, if I activate this, this doesn't lock. But when does this thing lock? That's what I'm struggling with right now. So first he comes, then I go here, in this corner. Okay. Come on, come on! Right, I, I go in here. Okay. Uh, okay, it didn't let, let me sprint there at the end. Where do I go from there? Wait, did the right path open at the end? Let's try this one more time. Run back here if I need to. I'm really struggling with what to do, every pony. This is so confusing. I have no clue. I'm completely lost. Okay, is there something in this corner that I didn't see? Let's take a look. Well, it's not there yet. Okay, there's nothing here. Let's take a look. So the right the right gate doesn't open. Huh? I don't know what the game wants. I have no clue. Okay, there's one idea that I have. One final idea that I've come up with. Okay. And that is, if this is dark, can I teleport from there to here? And if he's over there, can I lock him in? Okay, so let's see if this works. I, I don't know if that made any, se made any sense, but I have an idea and I think it could work. Okay, so let's go. So he's, gonna be so he's over here. Okay, over there. Okay. We got it! Yes! It worked! Sorry if that was loud, but I did it, every pony. Did, it. Mm -hmm. did we win? We made it, every pony. Please, is this the end? The shade had been defeated. Oh gosh, that was really tricky, but I didn't expect you could teleport there because of all the red orbs. Oh boy. So did we win? Huh. <sighs> Okay, that was some really tricky puzzling right at the end, but I I kind of didn't really have any other choices, but I, I, I understood that you had to trap him, but I didn't know which patch of sunlight. It especially confused me that she was like, when you come into this room and there's the first patch of sunlight, she's like, you can run back here, and I thought I have to go back there for safety measures. But then I realized, you know, wait a minute. You can lock him in there with the light and switch it on and then I realized, hey, you can teleport maybe. And then, yeah. What can I say? I loved the atmosphere of the game. It was really scary. The puzzles were amazing as you can see. They can confuse you a little bit there. 
and I think the atmosphere and the, the sounds and the voice acting and all that does make a good good game, you know. That being said, I completely loved this game, except for this one thing that we found, like, I think it was mostly during the first episode where we glitched through the floor and somehow managed to die. It was a little strange, but, you know, outside of that, what can I say? This is a lot of fun and definitely worth a play. But it's not anything for, you know, any pony who does not like scary games. That being said, if you're someone who does not like scary games, be careful about playing this or, you know, at least get a whole bunch of plushies and something that helps you be not scared or something, but, um, yay, thanks for all these ponies who made this game. <sighs> I really have to make sure Metal Lush does not play this game, though. She could have nightmares from this. Well, what did we learn from a game like this? Be careful what you read, and be careful which spells you cast, and be safe, right? Oh my, well, oh, is that, okay, what's this, is this like the title? It is the title. Okay, so with that, I thank all of you so much for watching. Even though it was short, it was sure something interesting and new. And with that, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.